<clears throat> I noticed in the last few years um, how famous Keith has made himself. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I, yeah. I'm so from the book. Like, and congratulations, everything. you're an author. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> congratulations, you're doing interviews. Um, and uh, congratulations, he's walked his ass into some trouble. Right. <laughs> Like, you know what I mean? Whether he did it or not. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. When you think about, because now Keefe D, oh, we got to talk about that. When you hear that they are rest. Oh, congratulations to him. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Right? Congratulations. I'm proud of him. Can <laughs> tell me uh, how you felt when you seen them raid his house and then they say, you know what? Not only we raiding his house, we, re we, we opening his case back up. We're arresting him. What was that you know, like? Um, I didn't really follow the case. You know, I had heard that his house had been raided and that just sounded weird by it being so many years. So many That's years. That's what I said. You know, that had gone by. But uh, <clears throat> I noticed in the last few years um, how famous Keith has made himself. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? I, yeah. I'm so... From the book like, and Congratulations, everything. you're mm -hmm. an author. No. <laughs> <laughs> congratulations, you're doing the interviews. Um... And uh, congratulations, he's walked his ass into some trouble. Right. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Whether he did it or not. Right, purposely you know I mean? or not. Uh, well, the, whether he was, he's the shooter or not. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? What, what, you know, we know the world that we live in. We know that the way the system go. You know, if the killer is dead or, you know, they may give him all of the... Yeah, that's what I'm Stuff saying. That they were supposed to give everybody else that he's talking about. So this congratulations. Dude writes a book like yeah. about this whole situation, and it's like he's putting it in I front of everybody. I don't know known for that. That's you know? what I'm saying. But I heard he was sick or something. And he yeah, thought he was be. gonna pass, and could he said, "I'm be. gonna just let it." Because you you remember the the, the, the Bob well, you know, Marley guy that said right. he's gonna let it all out. Yeah. So you know when you, when you that's one thing about you know the the, the spirit. The Holy Spirit. Come on now. You know, there's one thing about, conviction. you know, God and conviction. You know what I mean? I don't care how long your mouth stay closed. Come on now. You know what I mean? You just, you know what I mean? You could sew your lips up. Mm. And, and if it needs to be shown and it needs to be seen, you know, God is a perfect person to... Uh, magnify what we think we're exposing. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? That's so, right. So he put it under the light. Nobody was paying attention to him. I think he he got away perfect, perfectly mm -hmm. with the murder. He if was he was a murder. He was away. almost, you know what, he's like 90 years old. Yeah. <laughs> and, I mean, you know what I mean? So to live his last days, if, if they convict him or whatever this plan is, to live those days out in jail, if this makes him a little more comfortable. Congratulations. So be it, right? Yeah, but I wish him all the hard. Come, he, the thing is that people, pe maybe as like what you're saying, I never thought about it that way. He wanted to make himself right with God before it was time to go, so he had this confession. Well, <laughs> he I don't know if you made himself right with God. I don't know, it, nigga. You took pop. That's right, and that's not good. <laughs> well, you know, I just, I just hope that he's safe. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because he talked a lot about, you know, you know, different gangs in, in, mm -hmm. in Vegas and said how weak they were and yeah, all and of then, the real gang bangers is in L.A. So now he's in an unfamiliar place. Right. You see him sitting up. in the back of the car and he's like, you don't know who I am? He's telling the guy, like, you don't a know who I am. What they got you for, man? Biggest case in uh, Las Vegas history. Oh, yeah? He's kind of, you I'm know what I mean? I think biggest... he wanted to be known, especially be talking like that. I mean, what else would he be known for? That's that's the biggest thing he ever done in his life. Yeah. So besides he, besides gang banging and you know how how pretty or cute is it to hear a grown ass man talk about him gang banging? Mm, so, wow. I mean his ending story is being a part of you know a, a assassinating or killing Tupac, which is crazy. Mm. Which is crazy. crazy, man. You. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One One. Yeah, we gonna talk.